and welcome to the Crimson Dojo. Here we are in Tokyo, Japan. <coughs> dying and kicking off the week. Yep. And speaking of dying, <laughs> not really. He's not dead. He's not dead. He's nope. fine. <laughs> He's fine. As far as we know. As far as we know. And he's streaming Street Fighter V. Yeah, with, with no face cam. Yeah. And no talking. Because that's how you stream. Yeah. Anyway, it's Mike Ross. Yo, it's the people's champ. Or one of the people's champs. Yeah, Mr. Fourth Place. Yeah. He's by himself this week. Huh. Playing Roman Solo this week. Roman Solo? Roman Solo. Oh. Roman Solo. <laughs> Is that like a WWE Star Wars crossover? Oh, God. And Big Show be R two D two. Oh God, no! Anyway, Mike. Well, well, it's the beep boop. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were doing a Mike Ross impression. No. <laughs> Mike Ross looking very sweaty this week. I mean, you know, he just walked to the ring. He's always. Sweating. I mean, he might be. This oh, might be why no. he's. This is might be why he's sweating bricks. That might be. He's up against the old barbarian today. Yeah, the new warrior champion, Vig the Barbarian, victorious at harsh judgment, mm. defeating Jonathan Worcester two falls to one, to claim that warrior championship. And what a two one it was. It was holy shit. I mean, like, I, I like. Never bet against the Barbarian. Because hmm. it's like, yeah, you know, I was feeling pretty good for John when he was up one fall to nothing. Yeah, but and, then that changed in 12 seconds. And then I blinked, and then it was 1-1. Hmm. And Deke the Barbarian claiming his first Way of the Warrior Championship to go with his three Intercrosbidental title reigns as well as a, his, th his three Funtime Friendship title reigns. Hmm. He's ferocious yet decorated, mm. and the bell sounds and and Mike needs to work on his spacing. Yeah, Mike hit, oh, hits Ooh. him with a knee. Yo, he did the knee. He he might win. Knee. And that's the path, the, the, the yeah. first path to victory. And and that's yeah. that's not a path to victory at I all. Mean, oh God. Oh, that's not a path at all. Uh oh, oh I mean, no. it's a path. It's our best down. Oh, straight up, straight down, and is that it? I have one, one, two, two three. three. Oh, okay. Uh, your winner is being the Barbarian. I mean, I don't think anyone had any I'm doubt, but... I mean, I'm surprised at how fast it happened. Yeah, I kind of thought that would go on longer. I mean, Mike looked red, and there he goes. Yes, there he goes. And there he goes. Being the bar. Hey, wait a minute! Being the lesbian? What are you doing here? And he's got a kendo oh, stick! Oh, God! He's beating down Vig. What? What? Wrong. I mean, stupid baby, you're on the wrong show. Yeah, you weren't scheduled this week, as far as I know. I mean, it's like what? Yeah. I mean, what is going on with people doing whatever they want on this brand? I know, right? Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Crimson Dojo. Once again, here in the capital city of Tokyo, Japan, and this crowd is on their feet for good reason. Hey, it's the K-Brad. It's the K-Brad. It's the boy, the K-Brad. Yo, the 2020 Men's Warfenheimer Claimer. The boy won the chamber. Yeah. And he got that suitcase. <clears throat> Guarantees him any match he wants at any time. Look at, look at it, and it's... Splendor? Yeah, I mean, looks. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, he's not cashing in today. I don't, I don't think so, anyway. But the the boy is going to be keeping us on our toes. Because mm. that Warfenheimer, that whack ass briefcase with a J on it right there, <laughs> it entitles him to any match he wants at any time he wants. Mm. With anybody he wants. Yeah. Within reason. Don't be going out to the crowd and punching a kid. Yeah. But and, well, uh, there's Graham Noble. I mean, I'm pretty sure he'd punch a kid. Yeah, maybe. Old Graham Cracker's here, and looking as pissed as always. Mm. I mean, I'm pretty sure he wanted to win that chamber and win the Warframe Hammer for himself. Yeah. 
가방 먼저 하고 싶었습니다. 자, shut up, can. <coughs> anyway, Graham Noble is here, and this match is scheduled. K. Brad is not cashing in the Warfenheimer for this match. Yeah. So it'll be K. Brad and Graham Noble going one on one. One on one with the. The, the big one. Yeah. It's not really the big one. I mean, they're they're kind of big. Yeah. There's here the bell. Go, here we go. By Big Martin Lee. Starts off the kick. Gets punched. All in mind. He gets scooped mm -hmm. into a cool power slam. Big power slam. Right already back to one knee. There's the counter. Punched right to, right to the beer gut. Runs in. Yo. That clothesline is affecting him none. I mean, Graham is a big, big dude. Bulldog. The bulldog. Oh. Stomping at the glasses, it seems. I mean, it would be a weakness, but, like, don't do that. That's where the eyes go. Yeah. Good trust me, isn't it? Anyway, there's knee that looked like it hurt him, too. I was going to say, it looked, it looked like it hurt K-Brad. Toss him to the corner. The clothesline from in the corner. Right hand. hand. Can get the one. Throws him down. Whoa. Hard stomp. Right to the jaw. Come right on the beard it did. I don't know how much that beard's going to protect you. I mean, it's not, a, it's not a thick beard. It's not a... It's pretty scruffy. It's scruffy. It's not, it's not, it's not a Billy status of beard. Yeah. Billy's beard. It's not a mountain man beard. Yeah. And then with another close line in the corner. I'm going to get a close back in the I, I, I decided to fix it. <laughs> There's a headbutt. Whoa. And running Whoa. in. Whoa. K. Brett in like almost like a sleeper hole into a slam. There's cover. a cover. One. One. Zoom up. Nice kind of kick the right side leg. Hooks him into a neck breaker. Look around. Put him away. Big scoop. Big scoop. To the ropes. Oh, the old classic. Ooh. He went right back up, though. Right back into Graham's oh, hands. And right oh. back down with a suplex. That was, that was more of a throw than a suplex. Mm. Going into that gator death roll. Mm. Cross face. Oh, I didn't tap though. And Martin was right there. Arm wrench. Arm breaker. Catches the hand. Into a headbutt. Oh. Armas carry. To the ropes again. Yep. Oh. In the same spot, too. Graham is on a tear right now. In the, the powerbomb position. Uh oh. oh. Oops. Pile, Pile driver. driver. To a cover. cover. One. Two. Number two. two. That's cool. was right by those ropes, Martin. I mean, that was kind of questionable. Oh, boy. Oh, he ain't looking too good for the boy right now. No. Scoops him. Oh, uh -oh. the grand cracker. cracker. Into a cover. That cover. I could do it. One, One two, two, three. Yeah, and there you have it. Your winner is Graham Noble. My goodness. Graham was on. He was focused in that one. Kaber couldn't really do anything in that match. No, it's like every time he tried to get something going, Graham had an answer to it. Huh. A little bit of a wrench for the chamber, maybe. A little bit. I mean, l luckily for the boy, that the Warfenheimer was not at stake in that match. Yeah. He did it's not like, cash in. And he still has it. Yep. They may want to do some research and uh, development of yeah. his own being. Got to learn the matchups. Yeah. I mean, it's like, you, you could cash in it for anything you want. And, I mean, it only makes sense you'd want the Crimson Dojo title. Yeah. But, boy, you're going to 
do, you're gonna have to do your homework. If you're aiming for the marble, yeah, you're aiming for the marble. You better go and prepare. That that's all I'm saying. Yeah. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Crimson Dojo. Here once again in the capital city of Tokyo. Don't you ever get tired of being here? No. Nah. I mean, I'd rather be in Kyoto, actually, but, you know. I mean, anyway, it's main event time. It is. Capital indeed. city for the for capital talent with a capital main event. Because we got to figure, figure out who's going to be challenging the marble next. Yeah. And and this is a match we've had multiple times. I mean, between two decorated individuals, the clash of tag team partners. Hmm. It will be that man, Ace, one resident dad man, versus the other resident dad man. In Nate. a one-on-one -on -one dad v. dad competition. Yeah. And Ace, a former three-time world champion, sporting them sneakers. Yo, he, he's got to be pretty happy. Sonic movie, doing pretty pretty well in theaters, surprisingly. Yeah, I mean, at least the yeah. crowd is more in sync with his praises. Yeah, you know. Up. Oh. Praise, praise, praise. Pretzels. Pretzels. Pretzels? You know, you know maybe, maybe, maybe he says pretzels. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. I got, like, the trauma from, like, blue skies to, like, black skies, and there's Nate. Yep. The old soul dad guy. Yeah. I don't know why I never came up with that. Before. I know, right? I'm like, I, I saw, I'm like, you said that, and I'm like, how come we've never said that before? <laughs> anyway, Nate is here. Nate and Ace, the now former Funtime Friendship Champions. Unfortunately. I mean, when you're up against a, a real, legit tag team, there's only so much you can do. You know, I'd like to, you know, call upon the dumb wrestling board of directors <laughs> to review the tapes. I mean, clearly, people of the board, that 80 stampede is not a legal maneuver. It totally is. They are abusing the tag system. They are utilizing the best teamwork they can. I mean, yo, what better teamwork do you have? Then with two dads teaming up. I mean, apparently, of uh, the powerful bottom and the 80s. And because the, they lost. And the, the laundry man. And there's the bell. There's the bell. Here we go. We have a lockup. Ace Hold and Nate on. going on one on one to determine the, the new number one contender to the Crimson Dojo World Championship. Who's going to be challenging the marble next? Because clearly they can't cut it as tag talent. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> this, I mean, you're not wrong. I mean, they uh, got a springboard. Oh, nobody home. And Nate was starting to get up, decided to roll out of the way instead. I mean, Power 80s couldn't beat the contingency plan. I mean, like Dadman Inc. did. I mean, the contingency plan is housed of the Marvel and the Barbarian. And they lost to Dad and they, Dad. Well, and if. The, if the dads lost to the 80s of powerfulness, doesn't that mean that the powerful 80s are better than the contingency plan as, as far as association? Do you really want to say that Teddy Maples is better than the marble? No. <laughs> no, I really don't. Anyway. Anyway. And, Whoa, oh my that, goodness. That was a... They look like they melded together for what? one. I thought, I thought Ace was going to go for like a flash kick, and then you're right, it's like they just meshed together. <laughs> and, oh, duck under. Kick to the midsection. Oh. Knee, kick. Combination. Back four. Yo, know, Ace would surprisingly stupid, stupid fighting game knowledge. <laughs> and Nate, Nate hooks him to a swing neck breaker. Picks him up by his head. Oh, and just oh. chucks him. Goodness. Well, that's a, that's a, oh, yeah, he carried his wife across the threshold, and there it is again. So, he's 
<laughs> you were saying? I, I, I. So was. What? Ace the mistress in this relationship? I mean. Ace, that's a sin. <laughs> Nate is on that the top. Adultery. Nate, and Nate is just perched up like a and pro. Here he comes! Oh! oh. oh. <laughs> Yo, he's right back on the offensive though. That oh. was a that was a bad landing for Dad. I've never seen a dad splash so hard. <laughs> Flying Dad bomb! <laughs> and Ace with the athleticism once again. The 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 cartwheels moonsault thing, whatever. Yeah. And, uh, there's a cutter. Cutter. There's a cover. Right in the middle of the ring. One, One two. two. Cutter wasn't enough for the cover. Cover cutter. Even though he planted me right on his prominent bald head. But Dad is on the attack. Dad kick! No! No! Oh! He hits him with a dad kick of his own! And hooks him into oh. a German suplex! The prey kick. The, yeah. The, the yeah. communion kick. Yeah. Nice. It's and the, the Phoenix splash into a cover! One! Yeah. Two! I'm a two. I'm a two. I mean, you can, okay, you can look shocked at that. That Phoenix Splash has put down many an opponent. Oh, and he's, he's going for something else. And elbow drop. Elbow he's drop. The front splash. And All right, he's revving his motorcycle. You know, his God cycle. <laughs> going Monkey down, flip. Going down the the highway to he heaven. The last TV show. What well, was? Yeah. He's on the highway to heaven. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's how the song goes, right? Yeah, springboarding. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> Come on, guys. You two, you two former world champions. Oh my god. You are two former <laughs> world champions. You're better than that. Yeah. Front face lock into nothing. Your left hand. Yeah. Billy the back suplex. Billy the <laughs> Billy's <laughs> not here. No Billy's to be had. And, and oh, <laughs> I think I thought that hit. Dudes, maybe stay on the ground for a little bit. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh my god. Oh wait a minute! Oh, he's got, got hooked! Russian leg sweep. Take down. Hook down Phonics! Hook dad Phonics? Sure. I think I'm dead by Ace. Oh, oh roll, roll up. up. No. Oh, and it's a kick. Over the chin. Living up the, the holy motorcycle again. Yeah. And <laughs> flip it in the corner. That at least, at least that hit. The cutter? No. No. He couldn't capitalize. He goes into the corner. corner. There's a kick. Flops down. Cartwheel. Moon salt. Into a cover. Oh. One. One. Two. Two. Out of two. He's got some good momentum going here. Nate's not careful. He's not going to have any chance of winning this match. Ooh. There's a moon salt. Oh, nope. That's okay. Maybe the counter. Straight to the face. Pass him up. Nope. Straight to the, the arm ringer. Off the ropes. Into that double leg drop. Right to the gut. Cutter? No. Nate no. wants none of that. Couldn't capitalize. He's going after the arm now. That's his, uh, his no pain arm. That's his uh, wire clipping arm. Sure. Right hand blocked. Back. Nope. That's kind of there by Ace. Comes into the ropes. Man, Ace is on holy fire right now. One, two. Isn't that a sin? I, I don't know. Holy fire? I mean, anyway, it sounds cool. Yeah. 
Ace is on a roll here right now. I mean, Ace, I mean, Nate is just, just eating up the offense. I mean, it's not looking good for Nate here. Yeah. Little soul bad guy. Yo, oh, another cutter he gets away from. Here's your, your what, the, the dad assembly. Yeah. The, the grand dad fur. Yeah. The, the dad flame. Convert atomic drop into a double leg takedown and into a leg drop right across the abdomen. Almost to the family jewels. Yeah. Valencia. There's the cutter! There's the cutter. Couldn't avoid that one. Oh, and he's going right to the top rope. Please hit this. Don't Whoa! Oh. I mean, it wasn't the finish splash. It was an elbow drop. Yep. Go behind. Oh! oh that's it with a bridge! With a bridge! One! Two! Two! Dad suplex the bridge. He's going right back to the top rope. Oh! oh. The 630! 630 degree senton! Lands clean. Into the, the cover. cover. One! One. Two! Got a two! Nate stays alive. Mm. He doesn't want to go into that light. Like, how many times have we said it's one thing to be resilient? You gotta get some offense in. Yeah. And here's the start. Power! power bomb. A big power bomb! It's a cover! cover. One. one! Two! Cover two! Oh! He, he turns it! He flips it he into flips Dad Crab! Dad Crab! Dad Crab! He's pulling! He's pulling! Well, he's tapped here! He's right by those ropes, but Martin's right there! He can't reach! Oh, he gets away. That might be the big offensive maneuver that Nate needed to hit to get back into this fight. T pose for dominance. Get to the midsection. Barber for counter. Kick. Block. He got right back into the ring. Oh, oh, he the, poked him in the eye! He poked him in the eye! That's not very sportsmanlike. That's not very holy. Yeah. Did you see Jesus poking people in the eye? Was he? Never mind. Did he poke Saint Joseph when he uh, did that thing? Yeah. The, the three wise men <laughs> when he they delivered their gifts. A rub a thumb thumb and poking people in the eye. <laughs> oh, I told him a rub a thumb. Oh, the old Off classic. The ropes. <laughs> Oh, that leg takedown. Oh, gets back up, runs in. Oh! Ooh. That's flipping arm drag takedown. Long shot, kick in the midsection. Right hand. He's beating him down. Oh, there's oh, a there's cutter, the cutter though! Again. And hops up. I think Nate, Nate's busted open! Yeah, he is. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, this is risky. Please hit. Oh! Oh, it the, did! The slash! Crossbody! Cutter! Two! No! Oh! Wow! Wow! That was two and nine tenths right there. And he's going for another one. He's turning around. Phoenix Splash! Splash. Cover! Cover! cover. One, one! Two! Three! And there you have it! Your winner is Ace! Oh my goodness. That was a roller coaster. That was a roller coaster. Nate resilient, but. I mean, he, he got in some good offense there towards the end, but he took too much punishment. Divine punishment. Yeah. The yeah. old divine intervention of and black man. <laughs> and Robin? <laughs> to the black mobile. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no. Oh, that'll do it for this week's episode of the Crimson Toe Show. Oh yeah, tune in just a few days when we get 2GW underway. Yeah, and hopefully we'll have some answers. Yeah, and hopefully less racist. Yeah, bye. Bye.